Recap. So in our first episode, we secured four points in our two games for Lemonade's FC, which means that if we win both our games this episode, we'll secure promotion for Division 9. One step closer to our goal of reaching Division 1. Now for this to happen, we need all players in the club to live up to their standards, and I should point out, this is a strict club. Anyone who doesn't play up to their standards will get the cut. <laughs> And by that I mean discarding them. So will our players perform to their standards in today's two games and get promoted to Division 9? Or will we have to spend another episode in Division 10? Find out in today's episode of Lemonade's FC. <laughs> So welcome back to Lemonade's FC guys, now as I mentioned, we need to win both of our games today if we want to secure promotion for Division 9 this episode. Now before we get into all that, I decided to change the badge from the Derby City logo to just something black and yellow. I was looking for something a bit creative and a bit under the radar, and this is the only good one I can find. If you guys have any other suggestions for badges, leave it in the comment section below, but for now this is what we're going to be using. I also decided to change the kit from that black and yellow kit we used last game to the Bortmund FC kit. Just because because it looks a lot nicer, you know, and I thought it looked better using this one as our kit. Now, could this team today be the one that secures promotion? We never know. It looks like some players are a bit out of place. Looks like some need a few improvements. I mean, God knows what's going on on the bench. I've never seen any of these players before. Sad to think that these guys are probably never going to play in the starting 11 for Lemonade's FC. Like Collins. I mean, he could be a good defender, but we'll never know because... Well, he, he's just not good enough and we can't use him. And the bench aren't the only players that look out of place. Even the manager of our team looks like he's drifting off into the crowd in his own world, probably looking for his hair. Ah, there it is! Now, if we're going to win our two games today with confidence, we're going to need slight improvements. And how do we get the money to do that? Well, by buying more packs, of course. So we're going to open around 10 more packs this episode in maybe hopes of finding a new inform out of today's team of the week. Imagine grabbing an inform De Gea to upgrade from our common De Gea or even finding that inform Robin. It's unlikely, but you never know unless you try. So let's get down to it. So right now I'm going to switch to live commentary again of me opening these packs and I'll see you guys soon. So let's go. Right, hello there guys. Let's go ahead and start opening these packs. Hopefully we can find someone good to upgrade our team or sell on to get more coins. Ah, I don't know who that is, but he looks good. See, one thing that I don't understand is why do the fitness coaches always look like they hate their job. It must have been really difficult for the people taking the pictures for these cards to crack out a smile for this guy. Hey, where's my smile? Second pack. Kiss it. Ah! Oh, I thought he said kiss the ass. Pack number three. Ah, whatever. Pack number four. Smalling, uh, is he good? He goes for a bit. You know, I'll tell you what, let's keep you actually. Let's keep you as a substitute or something. We're still yet to get a half decent player that goes for a bit in this series. Could this be it? Ah! Well, PK, I think he goes for a bit. Cheeky 5,000 coins. Okay, we will take that. We will take that. Everything else just looks like dog crap. Oh, you like Right, okay, for this one, I'm not actually going to look at the screen. Right, so I don't know what I got yet. I don't know. Let's have a look. Ah, right, I'm actually going to discard this one without looking. So I'm not looking. Right, I think the pack's gone. Right, let's sell that. No idea what we got. I'll know later when I start editing this. Coke! I love a bit of Coke. Everyone loves a bit of Coke, am I right? He looks like he loves a bit of Coke, doesn't he? Oh, wait, no, he doesn't. He only has 23 pace. Disgusting. Still no fitness coaches smiling. Still yet to see one. What have we got here? What jaw? Oh, yeah, cheeky 6,000 coins. That's awesome. And a 1,000 coins. There's always hope. Achievement! But that... I... Why? I opened 20 packs. Oh. oh, I thought it would be like an inform achievement or something. Game, don't do that. Final pack of the day. Please, come on. I will be so happy. Oh, that's just a load of bullshit. Oh, no, we did get 4,000 coins. Okay. Okay. Okay, that's, that's okay. 
So now with 40,000 coins in the Lemonade's bank, I wanted to spend these on a load of different cheap but good players for Lemonade's FC. Start experimenting with loads of different players and see who works and who doesn't. Because this series just isn't about getting to Division 1, it's also making the perfect team. You know, last time I was so convinced I actually made the perfect team because everyone just played so well together, everyone was perfect and I started winning loads and loads of games with them and shot up straight to Division 1 once I had the perfect team. So first off, I decided to buy Cabela for our CAM position. He looks like a really good well-rounded player with pace and shooting and it looks like he could fit really well inside our squad. So Cabela, welcome to the team. I also bought a new left back, Moreno, replacing Monreal. Nothing wrong with Monreal, it's just it, it, this guy looks better. Now we also did buy a right back, he goes by the name of Coleman. Will he play well? Well, we don't know unless we try him. So, come on, welcome to the team. And lastly, I bought a new CDM, Ramirez. Oh. Uh. Steven Gerrard. Doesn't matter if he is a legend, is he going to be a Lemonators FC legend? There's only one way to find out. So, right now, here is a team for Lemonators FC. Looking solid. Looking very sweaty indeed. So, without further ado, let the games begin! Damn it! Come on, that's off. Oh, okay, for whatever, we can get back. That's right, Lemonades, keep your heads up. Oh shit, this is not going to well. Tick tock, tick tock, this is where the. I die. Shit. Shit! Ah! Ah! Jesus, this guy's good, guys. This guy is good. Cabela, Cabela, my son. Over to Eto. Eto gets past. Yes, Eto! Come on! Samuel Eto, holy shit, we got back, this happens all the time, I concede in the first few minutes but then I get back in the first few minutes, damn these players are quick, holy crap, this is really hard to defend against, oh, oh, great catch of hair, come on Lemonades, let's go, oh shit, uh oh, how did these players get through my defence, no, oh De Gea, De Gea, you are my saviour! Oh shit! That's, that could be a red! Oh, okay, that was close, okay. Oh, he made a mistake! And that was a really bad shot. It's okay because of... Oh, 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 oh god, we're getting close. Okay, we're getting closer. Eventually, one of these chances has got to go in. Oh! Yeah! <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> we got it back, guys! We got it back! Was that Eto again? Yes, it was! Samuel Eto, what a signing! Wasn't too good in the first episode, but he is bouncing back with two goals in a game that we need to win to get promoted. Wait, what's he doing? Why was he hugging the ball? You can't do that! We're in spotter's time here, lads. Free kick could secure this win. Oh! 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 Oh god, that was too close! Come on, Gerard, good delivery. Samueletto! And there we go! We've managed to win the game. There he is, Samueletto! The beast! The beast, Samueletto! has secured us this win. And De Gea. De Gea and Samueletto are the two guys that helped us win this game. Well played, Lemonators. Now we only need two more points to secure promotion for this episode for Division 9. So, let's move on to the next game and let's aim for all three points. Promotion is within touching distance for them now. They know they could clinch it today. What, what is with the dramatic opening? I never got that. I mean, I could do a better job as that. Come on, Lemonators. Let's play strong today. Stay focused. Oh, oh, Eto's through again. Yes! Yes, Eto! Samuel Eto, guys. Oh, my God. Look at the crowd go wild. This is such a beautiful sight. A goal from Eto a day keeps the relegation away. That was shit, I know. But this isn't. Oh! Oh! Eto! Eto! Would you look at that? Oh! Oh, if that went in... I don't, I don't know, I just wouldn't be able to cope. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Ah! Oh. No! 
Ah! Shit. Okay, we're back on level terms, but doesn't mean we still can't nab a winner. Come on, guys, let's focus and try and get it back. But I still believe we can win this, guys. Just concentrate. Right, Chadley's on the wing. Looking for people in the middle. Welbeck! Oh! Yes! Yes, Welbeck! We have got the lead back. Yes! Nice one, Welbeck! Eto and Welbeck fit like two peas in a can. Cheap goal, yes, I know, but sometimes you need to be cheap to win. And Gerard just... Wait, what's going on? Gerard just... Gerard just stormed through. And it's another goal. Huh. Okay, we'll take that. Gerard just scored. God, thank Christ for that. We have literally just stormed back into this game. But Cabello is hungry for more. And there's another goal. It's just another. It is just one after the other, after the other. Oh, but Chadley, over to Cabela. Is this game still not over? It's over. It's just all over now. Come on, ref. Just blow the whistle. There we go. There we go. There's the man. The man. Samuel Eto. De Gea, what an amazing keeper. The fans. What amazing fans. Look at that scoreline. 5-1 to eliminate his FC. And if I'm correct, we have been promoted to Division 9. Not much of an achievement, I know. But it's just nice to celebrate a promotion. So we're not promoted yet. We still have a chance to win the Division title. Which is basically just more coins for us. But now we know that we've officially been promoted. All thanks to Samuel Eto, Danny Welbeck and De Gea. Incredible players. But overall, gang, you all played incredibly well. That's why we've been promoted. More of this and we'll be in Division 1 in no time. Thanks for watching this episode of Lemonade's FC, guys. If you did enjoy it, be sure to leave a like. It does support this series and I appreciate it a lot. So, thanks for watching and I'll be seeing you guys next time in the next episode of Lemonade's FC.